plant powered. The means which Lawrence wants to use to propel to victory. He's vying for a fruity position, Britain's hottest vegan. It was all about uh, creating a platform uh, to get people talking about uh, veganism and the importance of uh, a, a plant-based diet. Um, and so far, the, the past 10 days for the campaign has been absolutely fantastic. Um, of course, it, it's hit the news, it's been on the internet, in the newspapers, and it's getting people to stop, look, and listen to what uh, vegans all around the country, not just the finalists, uh, and what P2UK uh, want to say. But there's more to this competition than Lawrence's dashing looks. Face value, it looks like a beauty contest, but the, the, the bigger picture is so much more. First and foremost, I'm a whistleblower for animals. So whether it's uh, in the street, I see it on the internet, through uh, petitions, campaigning, because veganism can simply be at home, sat at your computer, helping animals that way. You don't have to be in the street with placards doing it. Um, so the, the competition really drove home our contributions towards veganism and how we have helped animals. Um, and of course, well, it wanted to detail how we are as human beings, so what we do for fun, how we, how we uh, live. So I'm a, a really big fan of cosplay and sci-fi, um, and I think that's a really good way to uh, just have fun. And with great power comes great responsibility, which Lawrence wants to use to provide a voice to animals. The, the efforts have uh, benefited because uh, PETA obviously is a global organisation as well, it has benefited uh, animals all around the world, in this country and on our very doorstep in the Yorkshire area as well. And a tasty treat is up for grabs. The winners get a meal for two at a Michelin star restaurant in London. I mean, it's food. What more do you want? <laughs> um, and that's really good uh, because what a fantastic part of veganism is the food. I mean, I'm not going to lie. There is... It's opened so many doors to me. Uh, when I used to eat animals, I used to eat because food was there. But now it's, I, I like to explore food, it's an adventure. There are new tastes, new um, experiences right out there. It's great to ex uh, experiment with food um, and it's opened so many doors to me really. And what would becoming champion mean to Lawrence? It would be uh, an absolute uh, honour to be able to be that um, figure who can say, I've won this competition, not only for myself, not only for Peter, UK, but for animals. Um, and I would use that as a, as I said, as a platform to um, do even more. With the voting deadline on Friday, will Lawrence win? Either way, he said that he'd let us know. Aaron Renfrey, That's TV.